Hi, I'm Steve Small from IED Therapy UK, and I'm joined today by yeah, a distinguished Dave. visitor from the States. Thank, uh, thanks for having me, Steve. I'm Dave Wildermuth. I'm a Chief Marketing Officer for Dorsity, which makes movement sensors. Okay, so um, we're at Spinex Disc Clinic. Uh, where we provide IDD therapy and we've been using uh, VMOVE uh, movement sensors in conjunction with uh, IDD therapy to see how patients, um, how their movement improves during the IDD therapy and I just thought I'd ask David just, you know, obviously you're seeing things from around the world, how, how is VMOVE progressing, where is it used, what sort of things do you, do you see with VMOVE? Sure, so what, um, just for quick background, so VMOVE and Dorsity in general uh, takes human movement and then we turn it into actionable data. Right. So we take um, how um, typically a person would look at someone and say, oh, they're bending this way or they're moving that way. We can actually take that because our sensors would measure it very precisely, turn it into objective data so that, um, that so you can understand exactly how somebody is moving. Okay. So there are different applications. We use that for elite sports athletes. So. Uh, rugby players, soccer players, uh, gridiron football players in the U.S., uh, basketball players. And a lot of the ways that the teams use it is for recovery from injury, to know when somebody is ready to go back to return to play. Right. In the clinical space, for example, one of the things that our clinicians want to know is my therapy working. Right. Um, and so what we can do and what we've done in your case is be able to show that the therapy that you're prescribing for patients is actually progressing along and they're getting better. You can see it with your eyes, this gives you the hard data so it's not uh, a hunch yeah. or a feeling, it's objective data that can say yes or no, yeah. they're improving. And, and how is the, I mean we've been you know, really impressed with the data that we've been getting from our patients. Um, it's quite new here in the UK, how long has it been in the UK now? Yeah, so it's, all, it's been in the UK for about a year okay. and it's just, um, we're commercializing in different parts of the world, we're just starting in the United States. It started actually in Australia, okay. so it started with a, 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 physi a physiotherapist in Australia who was treating athletes, right. and one physical therapist would say, I see this, somebody else would say, I see this, yeah. and so well, this is kind of silly, this, is, this should be a known fact, how yeah. these people are moving. Yeah. So Andrew Rocky and his brother Dan founded the company, yeah. um, and it started in sports, and now it's spread into other areas. We also um, are in the workers' comp area, the work cover uh, for occupational health and safety, to really understand injuries at work and how we can help with that. Okay, so just to perhaps show um, people the actual units that we uh, use, just very quickly uh, David, so in terms of what we have here, what, what, are, what are these and... Um, yeah, so, the um, so these are all movement sensors, this is, um, so these, these are the movement sensors and inside this is kind of fancy technology, there's an accelerometer, a magnetometer and a gyroscope, yeah. so it can tell when someone is bending, yeah. it's precisely measuring how they're moving. This is really a muscle activity sensor, uh, kind of like an EGM, right. and um, it's me measuring muscle activity, so how a muscle is firing. Yeah. So th these would talk um, uh, remotely to um, wirelessly to this device, which we call an RFD, it's just a re remote device that measures it. Yeah. And then the clinician would plug this into a computer and download it. And the nice thing about the system is that it can be used when they're in the office. Right when the patient is in the office to measure what's happening. But also, and I think you know this better than, than uh, a lot of people would be, when the patient goes home, their be behavior is very different yeah. from how they are inside of a clinic. Yeah. And so what VMOVE can do is capture up to 24 hours how a patient is moving. And what's, what they find that I think is really revealing to them is they didn't know yeah. how much they were slouching or how much they were sitting um, in a 24-hour period, this um, is able to tell them exactly what their position was. And sometimes it's very eye-opening. They thought they were doing one thing, uh, and it turns out they were doing something different. I think we, we all perhaps have this idea that we're in good, proper posture, and as we're talking, and it's often the way, I'm sitting here, I'm slouched, and I'm not really thinking about it, and exactly. if I'm at my desk, I might be sat there for two or three hours without really moving. So, right. so that's, I think, um, I mean, certainly what we found when we've done the 24-hour testing is people really seeing actually when they're 
uh, when they're in their work, work environment that sometimes they're just really not moving and, and from, from say from an IDD therapy point of view that's the whole question of you know is, your, is, is the way you're living your life conducive to good disc health and this kind of objective data that we're able to get from, from, the, from the VMOVE uh, really shows people how, how they're behaving um, and, and where they need to make changes and, and it's very clear. Um, so, uh, so yeah, so, so you basically a clinic has um, this, uh, this kit and it uses it in the clinic and then patients yeah. can take it home. Um, yeah, it was think, interesting. What I, what I heard from your patients that I thought was really interesting was they were, um, they had great experiences with IDD. Yeah. Um, and really changing their, their lives from the beginning to the end of the, the sessions that, that you all were able to have with them, which I know is very satisfying for you and, and your team. Yeah. Um, but to them, one of the things that the move gave to them was proof. Yeah. Um, that here's, one, here's what was happening when I was away from the clinic, mm. not in front of the, of the clinician. Yeah. But also, you know, in this day and age when, when patients are spending a lot of money yeah. on health care, mm. to be able to actually almost have a scorecard that tells them I am actually improving. This isn't, I'm not just, I'm, it's not a placebo effect. Yeah. I can actually see this is happening. Mm. Um, I think that's what VMOVE can, can do for them. Mm. Um, it's like, you know, when you get a cholesterol test, you know, before and after where, where you are, when you weigh yourself, you've got a scorecard essentially. Are you, are you improving or not improving? Yeah. VMOVE is essentially like a movement scorecard. Yeah. You're seeing how you are before, yeah. you go through a therapy like IDD, and you see where you are afterwards, mm. and hopefully you're improving. I like, I like the, yeah, the the scorecard, the movement scorecard, or the spinal scorecard. It fits it fits very well with the whole uh, objectivity of, of of modern day treatment. So, um, David, thanks very much for you know taking the time to have a little uh, chat and sh and show us that. Um, what's the website where people can get more information about yep. this? It's uh, dorsavi.com. Dorsavi.com, and that's D-O-R-S-A-V-I.com. Okay. Thank you, David. Thank you. Thank you.